this new video um this is penny flower i hope you're doing well um today we have a haul from joanne's um i went to the u.s in florida to visit my friend anna who's creatively blessed anna on instagram and anna courtmanche i think on youtube um so i went to visit her for two weeks and i stayed with her and her family and i had such a great time so thank you um anna for hosting me and yeah so this is my second haul um i i'm gonna do a series from the united states i just did hobby lobby and this is all the stuff i got from joanne so yeah let's get into it there's quite a bit of stuff um i did two trips to jo well i went to two different joanne and i found quite a lot of stuff so yeah let's get into it okay so let me start with the beads as you can see i got a lot so we have a lot to go through so i got a lot of beads and i don't know where i'm gonna store them because i don't make dangles that often um but guess i, I guess now i'll have to <laughs> um but yeah i have um purchased quite a lot so i need to figure out how i'm gonna store everything uh, but so the first one that we have is this uh, candy uh, in like the Halloween style. I think these are super cute. I just want to eat them, uh, honestly. Um, and so I think when I went to Joanne's, all of the beads were like two ninety nine. So if you had like a strand that was ten ninety nine, then you were saving so much money. Um, so yeah, that was that was really nice. So I got, I think it was Joanne's. I'm not sure if it was Michael's or Joanne's, but I think it was Joanne's, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, then I got this one with different sizes of bees. I got a similar one from Hobby Lobby, but not the same colors exactly. Um, then I got this one with like orange bees for Halloween. I think they're super pretty. Um... <clears throat> I got this one, which these beads are so pretty. They're a little bit big, but they're really, really pretty. They're giving Grease vibes, in my opinion. Then we have these, which are also super pretty. In, like, black and white kind of style. And I love these with, like, the little flowers. I got this one, which is pretty simple. It's just black beads. I got this one with the um, snowman. I got this one. Um, these beads, which are blue, like a nice color, pastel blue. We really love these. Um, I got these, which are like little bees. They're so cute. Um, and I like that you have also the, the beads and like the bee colors. I got this one with the little cats. Is that a cat as well? I'm not sure, but I think they're really cute. I feel like this is a mouth, mouse, sorry. And these are cats, but maybe I'm wrong. I got this one which I absolutely love and I feel like this one uh, Anna also got um, these mushrooms and they're brown and I feel like they would go really well with the Forever Fields collection so that's why I got quite a lot of brown stuff I got these uh, rainbows I got this one with some pink and white-ish beads I got this one, which I think is so funny, with little um, Halloween beads. Really pretty. I got this one for like Valentine's Day with the uh, red hearts. And I like that it has like gold glitter inside. I got these Christmas hats. I thought at first, I think like if you don't look properly, you would think these are mushrooms, but they're like, they're actually Christmas hats. I got these, which, yeah, I don't know if I would use these for actual crafting, but, 
or like make more like a necklace out of it or something but i think i thought these were super pretty and i love anything like seashell and related to the sea um i got these which are like a nice red we can't really tell on the camera but it's like a nice bright red um that is like metallic color then i got these which i think these flowers are so pretty next i got we got i think anna got it as well i'm not sure um but this looks like a bracelet actually because it has the little clasp and then it's kind of like bracelet size but then i wouldn't wear this like as a bracelet but i think the individual like i don't even know if we can call these like beads but yeah i think they're super pretty so i got this um next i got these mushrooms which are so pretty i love them they're quite big but and heavy but they're pretty i got this one which is like a nice peach color um i got these bees which i feel like would go so well for marigold and like garden party i got these flowers flower beads which i think are so pretty and i think they're it, that would go really well with forever fields i also got these brown brown ones same for forever fields i feel like brown is the color i was also just in the fall vibes like i was ready for the fall autumn vibes so i got also this one which i really like that it has different type of beads and then I got more mushrooms um, in the red. And these are a little bit smaller. So that's nice. And then I got these fishies. I don't know that I would actually use them. But I thought they were super cute. So yeah. And I also got some charms. And I think these were also on sale. If I'm not mistaken. Um, it was actually Anna who was like. Oh Penelope look at this. Look at this. You should get this. And yeah. So I really like the little leaves there and the mushroom, um, the bee here, this like acorn, really cute. And I think this is supposed to be a pumpkin also. So these are cute. I'm really happy with the bees that I got. Next, I grabbed some stickers, of course, because I had to. I'm absolutely obsessed with dimensional stickers, so, uh, but these were not on sale, so... I was trying to hold myself because I didn't want to spend a ton of money. I don't think they were on sale, but don't quote me on it because I went to too many shops in two weeks um, so to remember everything. But I don't think that they were on sale. So um, I got this one with like Paris theme um, with the Eiffel Tower. And obviously, because I live in France, I feel like I would use this quite easily because I go to Paris quite often. Although I don't live there. Um, this is like a graduation theme. And like, again, because I'm graduating my bachelor in 2025 and then hopefully <laughs> and then um, and then I'll have to do a master and I'll gradu graduate again. I'm pretty sure I'll use these stickers. Um then I have these, which I thought were super cute and like Valentine's Day theme. These that say happy birthday. Honestly, I could have gotten like so many, like so much more, so many more stickers. But I was, I was really trying to behave. So this is super pretty in the like beach theme. I've never been to California, but I assume I will go once in my life because um, it's on my bucket list. So I yeah, I got these stickers and I thought they were super. Uh, and then I got these. I didn't know about this brand, but I thought their stickers were actually really pretty. Um, and I like that they're like really dimensional. And so you have this one that says beach. That's like bitch, uh, not bitch, beach themed. <laughs> um and yeah i think it's super pretty and I, since i go to the beach quite often because i really like to swim with the fishies um i feel like i would also use this really easily this one's about rome and that's really nice because i just went there 
this summer so i can use this um i i saw this in real life so i can use this all of this um for crafting um i haven't been to paris this year i'm not sure uh, but i go like almost every year because my best friend lives there so i can also craft this and same with london i haven't been in quite some time but i really like this city a lot so um i feel like i could craft with this easily either for like past trips or future ones um then um anna convinced me to get these like uh stickles thingies and it's so funny because i gave her like a side eye i was like why are you making me buy this but i did i like i bought it anyways without like i was like okay i'll buy it whatever um but then she showed me <laughs> what she actually used uh this for and she puts it like on her projects and like on flat for instance like ephemera that doesn't have any glitter or any dimension she like adds this like nice glitter thingies and then it make like gives a little bit of dimension to your ephemera and your projects in general so i want to try this because it looks really good on her projects next up um so i was super happy you guys i was so excited when i went um the second to the second joanne's which was a little bit bigger i was super happy because i had seen seen on um tina's uh youtube channels which is tina's crafty creations um that she had hauled in july some older crate paper stuff uh from joanne and i was like oh my god i hope that when i go they still have it which was a month later so tina obviously she told me she didn't know if they would have it still um and then we went to this place and i wasn't like thinking about it at all and then i go to this shelf and they had like a lot of stuff like older crate paper and like older collections there was also a lot of page evans on sale for like 99 cents like crazy like one dollar crazy cheap so i was super happy about this so let me show you what i got on sale <clears throat> so i didn't get that many things um but anna i think she got more she got some page evans as well um but i only got the stuff that interested me so i got this market square um like enamel dots i got these which i don't have this collection but i thought these charms were quite cute i like the cassette and the flamingo i got the good vibes frames and like this was for one dollar you guys one dollar and then they had some confetti i was super happy about this i mean probably if like this shelf had been there for a month there was probably more stuff before but i was still super happy to find these and then happiest purchase was the heart day sentiments which i didn't have and heart day is my absolute favorite collections of crate paper um i love crafting valentine's day so i was super happy to find these because i didn't have them before so i was super happy um i also grabbed a lot of um thickers that they had in like the shelves and um and there was also a lot of uh, older crate paper collections so I grabbed these. I don't know which collections they're from. I feel like Dear Lizzie probably, but I thought this was pretty. This is from Here and There by Crate Paper. So I got one. This is Flourish. So pretty. This one is Good Vibes, and I didn't have this one at all. So I was super happy to find a Good Vibes Thickers. Um, this is Hooray. I already have this, but I thought that was nice. <clears throat> Sorry, I had to go uh, get dinner. Um, so next up, we have this one, which is the Carousel Thickers. So I was happy to find these. These are the... Um, She's Magic, I think. Um, by Dear Lizzie uh, Thickers. And these were on sale, I think, um, for like quite 
like very cheap so that was nice and um then they also had the parasol stickers uh stickers on sale so i got two so i was really happy to find that um <clears throat> next up i found um the new collections by maggie holmes and bea valens so first from the oh i forgot uh these stickers from jolie's i got these like cacti and like these mermaids i think they're super pretty so i got two of the ephemera and this is what it looks like i think these are the journaling cards they're not the ephemera per se um <clears throat> and they were 3.99 i got the uh, puffy stickers which i was super happy to find and these were i don't know the price is not on here um i found the enamel dots and i found one of the sticker sheets and i don't know what you guys think about this but i'm not a super big fan that they're like matte and they're not shiny i like the shiny stickers like the shiny finish better but otherwise i feel like this is such a cute collection i love the brown and like the autumn feel i feel like i'm such in like a, a fall mood like i want to watch gilmore girls and do all of the fall things and like put like really cute fall outfits on so this is definitely like matching my mood right now um but yeah i'm happy i found those and these were like the last ones like me and anna came there and they had like almost yeah nothing left of the collections and then i found the project pad which i was super happy about <clears throat> So I'm not going to open it, but these are the colors inside. I like the mustard, brown, pink, light pink, I like green, almost black. And then these are the pattern papers that are inside. I like the gingham. You have like um, color parts gold one gold hearts this is giving the um, gingham collection what what was it called um oh gingham garden i feel like this is kind of similar to that collection <clears throat> and then you have the alpha stickers and the like normal stickers which have gold foil on them so i feel like that's really nice and this is what they look like so that's for the forever field so i'm happy i have some of it i'll probably make an order and grab the entire collection but that was nice and then i found some of the sketchbook but not everything um i don't know why but the other puppy and pear is not being sold on craftelier so i wasn't able to get it uh, uh, like although i really wanted to get it but i'm happy that i have some of this sketchbook and i think it's a really really pretty collection so i found the stickers same i'm like not super happy that they're matte but i guess you have to do with what you have and then um they had the enamel dots i don't know how i feel about the colors though i feel like why did they choose like dark blue and black when they could have chosen like some nice purple or green or red but anyways i really like these puffy stickers they didn't have any more of the ephemera <clears throat> and then oh i forgot i also got the six by eight but i left them in my suitcase um so i guess i won't show you that here um but this is the project pad i really like the colors Ooh, I love this paper with the flaming uh the swans. Oh, I love this one as well. And then you have some with the gold foil and like the frames. And then oh, this is a nice alphabet. I like the gold alphabet. 
And then these are the stickers, which you can also find here. <clears throat> so I was super happy to find this. Uh, next thing I got, this was on sale, I think, and these are, like, si similar to the flowers I got in Hobby Lobby, and they're, like, little pink and purple flowers. So I was really happy to find these. Um, then I got the single papers from, from Sketchbook, some of the single papers from Sketchbook and Forever Fields. So these are the cut aparts, and this is the back. This is such a pretty paper. I love the flowers. I love this one with the lemons, and I love the back as well. It's really pretty. This one with the butterflies. This is reminding me of Sweet Story. Um, and then we have this one with the hearts, and I love the checkboard and then these are forever fields papers i really like this one this one's also really nice with the flowers this is the music notes which i also really like i really like the colors in this it's very pretty and then this one and i also really like the back polka dots i think they're really pretty so that's the papers and then i got more like specialty papers from joanne's i got these vellums so i got this one which has some bunnies and flowers that would go also really well with forever feels this is from garden party I got this one, which is a, an acetate with some, like, really pretty flowers. And then I got this one, which is, like, a map. And I think that's really pretty. I got this acetate, which Anna was like, you need to get this one. It's so pretty with the polka dots and gold. Um, I also got this one, which has some flowers and gold. <clears throat> I got this um, mirror paper. It's me high. Um, the mirror paper, like gold, yeah, metallic. And then I got some uh, Mylar acetate. Like this one is like the pastel, and this is the dark pink, purple, purplish iridescent acetate. So that's it for Joanne's, you guys. I hope you liked all of my purchases. Um, I hope you liked this video. And don't hesitate to go check out my other hauls and my channel. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and you'd like to see more of these videos. Uh, thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next crafty video. Bye bye.